Hey plant gang, standing in front of one of our truly outstanding North American native shrubs, Calicarpa Americana Beauty Berry. Uh, here, first week of July, in full bloom. Uh, a great shrub uh, that is used out, out through the entire eastern United States, uh, right now in full bloom, and this will transform itself over the season into beautiful berries. So Calicarpa Americana, you can see the blooms going up and down the stem. These leaves are oppositely arranged right off of each other. Uh, other thing about Calicarpa is it is densely pubescent. There's actually real fuzziness all over this plant. And you can see just really starting to bloom now. It'll start down low and then the blooms start to move up the stem. But every one of these little blooms that are on here will transform into a metallic purple berry uh, that really goes up and down the stems. Now this plant really I think is still underused in the home landscape and it really is a showstopper in the fall. Right now it's just kind of a big green meatball uh, until it just started to bloom. It's starting to get some interest uh, but in the fall people love this plant. It is truly a showstopper. How big does it get? Three to ten foot tall spreading out three to ten foot wide so quite large and so you have to be ready for that. Now you can prune this back even in the early spring and still get uh, flowers and so uh, you can uh, manage the height of this if you absolutely need to. Uh, e in fact, in places like the Great Plains where this is not uh, top hardy, they'll actually use this as a dieback shrub and there's plenty of a time for it to grow back once it's established and still produce fruit. Hardy from zone 7 through 11, uh, but again, even in zone 5, you can grow this as a dieback shrub, and so you uh, maybe be prepared for seeing it in places where it's not zone 7 hardy. Here's a landscape tip. North American native shrub with beautiful metallic purple berries in the fall.